National Security Minister Fitzgerald Hines yesterday said crime is a disease like COVID-19 and just like COVID, it has to be treated as such with everyone playing their part to fight it. Hines was asked to respond to the current murder toll, which, according to him, stood at 555 up to last night, with 250 of these murders being classified as gang-related and 87% of the 250 murders being committed using illegal guns. The Express caught up to the minister yesterday following a handover ceremony of two drones donated to the National Security Ministry by the United Nations Office on Drugs and Crime, ANAC. The event was held at the ministry's Temple Court, Port of Spain, headquarters. Asked about the toll as well as murders in general, he responded, It reflects what we have said before about the extent and levels of violence that we have been able to perpetrate on each other, and in some cases, our visitors to Trinidad and Tobago. It simply says we are becoming an increasingly violent society, and it also suggests that law enforcement has a lot more to do in suppressing the violent nature of the gangs. He also spoke on the importance of the community in tackling crime. The approach we are taking requires community engagement. It requires every NGO, even faith-based organizations. All of us, Heinz stressed. He said just like with COVID, 19 people bought sanitizers and chose to use masks, and we gave up the business of hugging and kissing because we as individuals had a role to play in pushing back COVID-19. And with treating violence as a public health issue, it is no different. He added that just as someone chose not to spread COVID-19, they can also choose not to engage in violence. In this fight, individuals have to play a role. Parents have to play a role. Teachers have to play a role. The media has to play a role because this ain't no joke. It kills us, just like COVID-19, he said. Hines also dealt with the upsurge in murders, especially in Belmont, over the last two weeks. He said patrols were increased in both East Port of Spain and Belmont, and added that this was the reason they were so grateful for the donation of the two drones from the UN. It will allow us a direct attack on that, as we do all the things we have to do, he said. He said this explains why the government has begun treating violence like a public health concern, which he said required an international effort and a regional one. It is why we join forces with CARICOM and we now have CARICOM Impacts, Implementation Agency for Crime and Security, and we have established the Crime Gun Intelligence Unit, he said. He said the region, as well, was also affected by violence.